An Orlando woman is hoping to get results after a heartbreaking theft. Yeah, she says her French bulldog, Stuart, was taken from her home on Christmas Eve. It happened at her home on Davison Avenue, not far from Lee Road and Edgewater Drive. News 6's Vanessa Ariza spoke to that woman today. She joins us now live. And Vanessa, is there any word yet on who could have done this? Not at this time, Lisa. The owner tells me when she came home, this back gate was completely open. On top of that, she came back here. She noticed that these lights in the back of her house, well, the bulbs were taken out. And to add to everything else, when she got closer to her back door, she noticed that it was kicked in. It's bolted and padlocked. That was locked and that was locked. But you can see. You know, it don't take much. Teresa Luce is heartbroken after she says someone broke into her home Christmas Eve evening and took her beloved Stuart, a one-year-old French bulldog. I opened the door and his doghouse that you've seen in the picture was gone. I knew immediately somebody broke in. She believes whoever took him had their eyes set on him, noting nothing but the dog, cage, and toy were taken. My computer's sitting in there. They didn't even pick that up. They come for the dog. This is the second time Luce's home has been the target of a break-in in the past month and a half, but she feels this one had the sole purpose of stealing Stuart. Why do you have to steal somebody's heart? To What are you getting out of that? That's what I'd like to understand. She bought Stuart after her dad passed away last year to help her cope with his death. He just brought so much love, love to me and Anybody that got in touch with the dog or me could see how well I was doing with uh, coping with the grieving of my dad. And then it's not even a year later that now he's taken from me. Now, Luce has filed a report with the Orange County Sheriff's Office. She tells me that she was thinking about taking Stuart with her that evening, but at the end decided against it. Now, coming up tonight at 6, I'll tell you what she has to say to the person or persons who took her beloved Stuart and what she has to offer them if they do return him safely. Lisa. Mm, sad story. Vanessa, thank you.